All right, everybody. Welcome back to another part of this Fallout New Vegas walkthrough. So last time we finished off Lonesome Road. Now all we have left is the Yes Man missions. So I did a little research on what, like, what I need to do, and I figured out, like, oh my papa for the great cons. There's honestly no point in doing because he won't help Yes Man. The only way you get help from the great cons is if you're doing an NCR playthrough. And Yes Man is pretty much just a house playthrough, except you're taking control. So, there's no real point in doing Oh My Papa, so I'm not even going to worry about that. I've technically finished the uh, wild card side bets, I'm just not going to turn it in. So the first thing I'm going to do is change in management. I need to go get the platinum chip from Benny. That means I need to go to the fort. It's kind of the same mission, render on, to, render on to Kaisar, travel to Cottonwood Cove and take the barge up the river to the fort. But I'm really just there for the chip from Benny and kill him for killing me and then running away like a coward. And then go back to the strip and kill or disable Mr. House. I don't know which one I'm going to do yet. I'll probably just kill him and we'll go on from there. So let's head down to what's the closest location I got. Because we're going to Cottonwood Cove. So the closest thing I got, Camp Searchlight. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, it's on the road. Why do I have two waypoints? Oh, yeah, it's showing uh, Mr. House as well. I forgot. This is going to take me right through the... I forgot this road takes me right through the radiation. I brought Eddie along because once you do Lonesome Road, oh, well, I chose the sacrifice ending, obviously, but you can, uh, every upgrade that you get for Eddie in Lonesome Road travels over to Eddie in the uh, Mojave Wasteland. Like it says in the ending, it sends them, uh, sends Eddie in the Mojave a signal telling him what happened and giving him the upgrades. So that's why I went so hard on getting all five upgrades is because Eddie's, I mean, tied for my favorite companion. Boone is partly my favorite because he's just, he's just a badass. And he's freaking ridiculously deadly with that sniper. But Eddie's also up there as like, this dude's freaking cool. There's an enemy down here somewhere. Is that a ghoul or what? Oh, that's a glowing one, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Is there anybody else around us? I got this Blade of the West out. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah, but Eddie's pretty cool. So, I wanted him to bring him along. And he can do that repair a weapon once a day, which is very handy. When you run, blow through all your repair kits like I do. I hate that you have to go into uh, Legion territory to do this ending. Or to do really any ending. You have to go get the chip from Benny. And he's at the fort. But I just... Uh, they're so scummy. Like, the whole Legion is just the worst. I hate every second of it. And you cannot bring Boone with you. That's why I had to bring Eddie. I wanted a companion, because Meat Shield, that's where it's at. Even though they're awesome, they're good at soaking up attention and bullets. But if you bring Boone, he'll just start shooting Legion, and then you're vilified. In like a, a split second, so. And I did, in fact, learn that the hard way. So, <laughs> there's a lesson there. I didn't bring him here, but I did bring him around some Legion. And he just starts blasting. So don't do that. Yep, you're about to say something. Halt! What business have you in Cottonwood Cove, outsider? I was invited. You were the Mark of Kaisar. You must be who Cursor Lucullus is waiting for. You may continue, but be warned. Mark or... Oh, shut up. I'd kill you all. If I could, I'd, I'd wipe you all off the face of the earth. Honestly, I might. Before I start the second battle of Hoover Dam. 
I might just wipe these this whole place off the map. I brought my fat man. I went back to the Lucky 38 and I got some weapons. But I brought the fat man with me. I don't have a lot of mini nukes, but I still have mini nukes. I also brought stuff like the h and Tools nail gun and the Sleepy Time. All the silent stuff I have. So I got nail gun, Sleepy Time submachine gun, and the uh, silenced rifle. So if I need to start picking stuff off, picking bad guys off with uh, uh, Stealth Boy enabled, I will. So you must be Cursor Lucullus. Yep. Uh, I'll wait. Are you ready to head up river? Uh Yeah, sure. The trip will take a few hours. Take your place on the boat. That was quick. By order of really? Kaisar, all visitors must dis Whatever, your I don't care. Will be returned to you when you I don't give a crap. Oh, I get to keep sleepy time. That's a huge mistake on y'all's part. And the 21 frag grenades. And lucky, for that matter. I mean, sleepy time alone will wreck everybody. Lucky is amazing. And I got my 21 frag grenades. That's a huge oversight there. See, this is why the Legion sucks. They straight up just got slaves. Are you a traitor? You look like a traitor. So you're the visitor I've heard so So you don't sell any weapons. You're pointless. I'm sorry, dude. I'm about to, to be fair to you. I'm about to wipe this whole place off the map. The Legion is dying, so I'm gonna kill him. But you have a lot of options. So you could go a Legion if you're just a horrible person. That's not true. It's just a video game. But they're just not a good ending. Uh, you can do Legion, NCR. Fair enough, like, they're not a horrible ending. You can go House or Yes Man, which are my favorite two endings. Is this where I go? Okay. D worried I crashed there for a sec. Is this where I'm even supposed to go? Yeah, okay. So I guess the big camp over there is going to be... Kaisar's camp. Can I go on the right side here? Some of the slaves have been spreading stories about the burned man again. Well, I met him. Oh, I should have worn Joshua Graham's armor. Oh, that was a huge mistake on my part. That would have been awesome. Tent flap to Kaisar's camp. You must enter Kaisar's tent a I don't whatever. You must enter oh, Kaisar's so I have to tent. Okay, Eddie, stay here. Wait here. Some of the slaves have been spreading stories about the burned man again. So I finally get to meet the courier who's accomplished so much in so little time. That's why I summoned you here, right? I mean, a man nearly kills you, and your response is to track him across the breadth of the Mojave? You arrive on the strip and waltz into the Lucky 38 like someone left you a key under the doormat? You visit the tops, and next thing you know, the head of the chairman is fleeing the strip like a whimpering little pup? When you set your mind to something, you get results. I like that. The question is, are you ready to get started? Um, just let me deal with Benny and I'll be on my way. Benny is my prisoner. Don't worry. You'll get the platinum. The time is fast. Before that happens, I want Mr. House knocked out of the game. A quick one-two punch with you doing the punching. What do I have to do? Down the hill at the west edge of camp is an old building. It was here when the fort was taken in 2277. 
Inside the building is a hatch, and inside that hatch are two steel doors that bear the sigil of the Lucky 38 Casino. Now that same sigil is on the platinum chip Benny was carrying when we captured him. Isn't that interesting? Even more interesting, there's a slot about the same... I think the platinum chip opens those doors. Doors that can't be pried open, or drilled open, or blasted open. Because all that, I tried. I want you to destroy whatever you find in there. And then I want you to come back here and tell me about it. So go to the building and take this fucking platinum chip with you. My legionaries will meet you there, with your weapons and equipment. Talk to Benny on your way out. He knows I'm going to let you decide how he dies. Maybe you want to remind him. Can I just keep... Oh, Benny. That's what I'm talking about. Go ahead and laugh, baby. I ain't blind to the humor in this situation. It is pretty funny. Yeah, well, laugh it up on your own time. Down to brass tacks. How'd your meet and greet with Baldy go? Caesar's Kaiser says I get to decide how you die. Try not to smile so wide, baby. You might break your mouth. Yeah, Baldy said you'd get to decide. So which way are you leaning? Um. Sweet to offer, baby, but if you cut these rope. Now, on the other hand, if I had a stealth boy. What do I. What do I want to do here? Do I want to let him go, or do I want to kill him for shooting me in the head? Because he's part of the Yes Man ending. Like, he doesn't seem like a horrible person. Oh, let me, let me think about this. I low-key, like, he's not a bad character. So we could straight up just take our chances and just try to fight my way out. Um, if I help you escape, what will you do next? Baby, if you show me the door to Scramsville, that's where I'll go. Out of your hair, never to return. I've been a fink to you. Caused more than my share of grief by a hard mile. Let me go. You won't see me again. So if I never see him again, like, I can just... No one... Um... I'm not gonna crucify him. That's a Legion ending right there. So either or fight in the arena or let him go. You do that for me. Sure. Oh, you don't want to do that, baby. Whatever's down in that bunk, you go down there and you use the chip to do whatever Mr. House would have wanted you to do. And when you get back to the strip, you find Yes Man. I made it so that cat can't help but be helpful. Dig? You know what? Baby, your generosity and spirit of forgiveness? Off the charts. This little care package is everything I need. I'll take it from here. Another kill to my name. Oh, that is... Oh, that is not good. Well, we're going to do this the very difficult way. Eddie, follow me. This is not good. Okay. So, where is... Legate's camp. Wow. So. This is not. I'm going to make a. Oh, I should have made a save. I'm going to make another save. We're going to see how this goes. If I die, I'll go back to. I gotta find where this goes. That way. 
Eddie's unconscious. That's very quick. You, there's a lot of you. You know what? Sleepy time. Oh, y'all, y'all are strong. You'll pay for that. Y'all are very strong. <laughs> what the heck? That's ridiculous. Uh, and I'm running into more of them. Come on. Dude, all the melee guys are running behind me. This is freaking awesome. I don't know if I'm going to make it. Go inside. Quick. Oh, okay. Well, we're just going to... We're going to rerun this. You must enter Kaiser. Oh, shut up. I forgot. Stay here. Our way. We're going to skip through the dialogue. Oh, shut up. So I finally get to me. Well, go ahead and laugh, baby. Sure. Oh, you don't want to do that, baby. You go down there and you use the chip to do whatever Mr. House would have wanted you to do. I made it. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna eventually so fight in the duel. Spreading stories about the burned man again. Eddie, follow me. Okay, I didn't realize. I was really hoping I could let him escape because he gave me the tip of like what I should do. I didn't realize it was going to immediately start combat. I didn't think he was going to use it right away. I thought there would be a break and then he'd use it. But no, as soon as I give him the stealth boy, it just goes invisible right in front of the whole freaking camp and Kaiser. Oh, I wonder what's going to happen. Dummy, could have waited. I was hoping I could let him escape because I'd... He gave me that tip. I don't want to kill him. I mean, he probably has some good stuff like that suit he has on, but... Why the freak did he have to use it right away? That's stupid. Kaisar has permitted your weapon. Alright. Give him back then. Some of the slaves have been spreading stories about the burned man again. What what do I do in here? Turn on the light. Oh, over here. So what is my quest saying? I'm not going to demolish the house. Should I be doing you and what army? make a save I don't sometimes if you uh, go the wrong way and do one mission first you can soft lock it so I don't want to accidentally uh, mess up my ending here so we're gonna see what happens why is everywhere filled with radiation well this is where I wanted you to end up after all I Was that meant to be a shocking? But you're not going to do that. Fine, you're... The platinum chip is a data storage device. I need you to manually upload the data from the chip to the facility's primary computer. There's a terminal at the other end of this facility. There's a complication. While I can broadcast to this... That means I can't deactivate its security bots, most of which appear to be... So I had to fight, okay. Okay. Well, it's a good thing I, I think I brought the Elijah's Advanced Layer with me. I'll have, uh... Can you repair this?
Thank you. Turrets active, projectrons, sentry bots. Everything's active. Oh, that was weak. What's this way? Oh, weapons. Well, oh. can I turn these all off if I have the high enough level for it? Because I'll just I'll turn disable them all if I can. One more dud. There we go. No, nope, there's two. Crap. Got to be another. Well, I have plenty of options. If I can disable them all, that'd be even better. Oh, well, that's fantastic. Okay. Can I disable turrets as well? Skip through. I just want to... Dud removed. Oh, dang it. Okay, we're gonna go with this one. Well, there's only other one option. That's this is fantastic. Sentry bots. Oh, so I'm probably still gonna have to fight through sentry bots. I weigh so much. I don't want pulse grenades. More pulse grenades. I'll take those. And a plasma rifle. See, they're all friendly now. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Do not interfere with security operations. That would have been... Okay, so I, I guess... If I didn't disable these guys, I probably would have had to fight through them when I was exiting the place. Oh, this is so good. Move along, please. Upgrade the Securitron army to use later for your own purposes, is what I'm going to do. Uh, yeah, I'm going to upgrade. So, this looks like the reactor that I can overload. Yeah, I'm not going to... Don't destroy those. Nice flame refuel. So, I do not want to destroy this place. That's another reactor. Where is the upgrade terminal? Where the heck you heading to? Systems room. Well, what's down here still? Oh, these are these are just all reactors. So if I destroy those, I can destroy the plant. Yeah, three reactors. Systems room is where I upgrade. Oh my god. This is why you go with house or yes man. You get a freaking Securitron army. Okay, that's sick. Let's... So what do I do now? I'm, I am going to return to Caesar so I can kill Benny. So I guess that's where I'll head back to. That's sick. Oh, I can't wait to use you guys. Oh, this is awesome. 
this was a thousand percent worth it. Your work here is done. You have a. Yeah, whatever, dude. I don't care. I gotta return to Kaisar. Let me keep my weapons. I need to go kill Benny. Oh, that was. You've carried out Kaisar's. Oh, whatever. I don't care, dude. See, you noticed when I had to, uh, when I accidentally let Benny go, and you're fighting all these guys. The only ones I actually killed were the freaking dogs. Because the rest of Caesar's army is stupid strong. Like, the NCR are weak beyond belief. Like, when you oh, fight, except for you when you fight the Rangers, the rest of the freaking army is stupid weak. But then you fight uh, Caesar's Legion, and it's ridiculous. Hey, Eddie, come here. I need to get you to wait here. There we go. Let me return to you so I can. I felt the ground shake. There are rewards. Go to Benny. Thank you. Oh, and I leveled up. So we're gonna do melee weapons. That's pretty handy, but I don't care. I just want to see if there's any uh, melee weapon perks. No, I guess we're going to go... Uh, I mean, there's no point in going Fortune Finder. I'm at the, at the end of the game. Let's just go... Let me go with the adamantium skeleton I've been waiting forever to do. Whatever. Okay, Benny. So, baby, what did you find? So, all this time, the old man had an entire army on layaway? Clever player. Just imagine the look on Baldi's face when those Securitrons come pouring out on Judgment Day. I'd pay to have that bronze. So all you gotta do is... Make Vegas a town I... I... If I... What wait, am I gonna say? hold up. No thanks. If you can get these ropes... Oh, what do I want to do? Because I'm not going to side with the Legion. I'm not doing any more missions for him. I can't kill Caesar. You think... No. What's holding you up? We're gonna... Machetes... Now we're gonna fight with... Fight in the arena. We're not gonna make it out. One of us is gonna die if we, hey. uh... Try to fight our way out. I'm gonna ring your bell, creep. Oh, shut up. Had enough? Sorry, Benny. I really didn't want to do this to you. But there's no way we're making out of this camp. There's too many of these guys for us to be able to fight. Ooh, that was worth it. Maria. They hardly even know how to fight. Well, let me, uh, let me go get Eddie back. 
And I'm not talking to Caesar. I don't care about that. We're leaving. We're going to go talk to Yes Man. About what to do next. Follow me. So we're going to... None of these guys are enemies, so I can just... Yeah, okay. Return to Yes Man. So, strip north gate. <coughs> nice. Okay. These guys haven't gotten the upgrade, so we're going to go to the tops. After I get my weapons back out here. I didn't even get to use Blade of the West, which sucks. Okay, go to the Tops Casino. And go find Yes Man. Then I gotta figure out how to disable Mr. House. And I think we're just on to the final battle of Hoover Dam. I can't wait. Dude, this Securitron army is gonna wreck everybody. Like, I, I understand that... <gasps> He's out here? Don't you just love that pla If I were you, I'd almost want to deliver the chip to Mr. House. Just to learn all its tricks. That is, unless you want to bring the NCR or Caesar's Legion to power, I wouldn't want to tell you what to do. The boomers have vowed to support me. Really? Talk about diplomatic skills. I mean, just not getting blown up was a success. Now they'll only blow up. That's what... Uh, visited the con settlement. They can be ignored. If you say so. Uh. Leave the Omeritas alone. It. I solved the cannibalism problem of the White Glove Society. A cannibalism problem? That's for... And I destroyed the Brotherhood of you Steel. You really... That accounts for... As soon as Mr. House is out of them. Okay. Now, how do, I don't know how to disable, kill or disable Mr. House. So, we're going to figure that out. Dude, I, I had so much stuff in inventory. I'm not going to work with the NCR. I'm just not. They're incredibly incompetent. And Lonesome Road showed that they just can't win. Because that missile is technically still waiting at the divide. Let's make a save here. Um, Where to, partner? I guess we're going to Penthouse. Well, oh, there must be another, be like... Visitors will be held responsible for the behavior of any robots in the company. Must be something down here if I can... What is this? Engaging target. Targeting. Oh god. I guess um control room. We're going to see what we need to do here. Unseal LS chamber. Talk to Mr. House. Ooh, let's skip through it. Ah, it's just business. Time for you to die, Mr. House. Why is it still saying talk? Okay, there it is. So, I think we need to go talk to Yes Man again. Penthouse. Be advised, the lucky thirty eight is not open to the general public. Trespassers. We fail all these quests, but I mean that's kind of part of it. Victor's not here, and I can access the elevator. So let's go find Yes Man. Mr. 
Let's go. Meet Yes Man at the Luck. What is the quest? Change in management. Make a save here. Oh, he just vanished. Did he just teleport into the penthouse? Yeah, Victor's gone, so he was definitely his, uh, like, inside man to get me to do certain things for him. Oh, here we go. Hi! Here we go! You're not at the keyboard. Why? What are you typing into? Wow, Mr. House had quite a setup. Wait, Mr. House had a whole demonstration planned for you. What is Step this? Closer to the demonstration area, please. Okay, I'll take all so of these. Securitrons by now, obviously. I mean, some of your best friends are Securitrons, right? <laughs> Ooh, I almost dropped in. Our titanium alloy housing does a good job of protecting our delicate electronic insides from small arms fire and shrapnel. Our left arm contains an X-25 Gatling laser, quite deadly against off targets in medium range. That looks like fun. And for close range suppression and crowd control, we have this handy dandy 9mm submachine gun. Nice. All of this is old hat, right? Here is where it gets interesting. Turns out that those are our secondary weapons. All this time we've been running the Mark I operating system, which doesn't have drivers for our primary weapons. Imagine! Now watch this. I'm downloading the Mark II OS to all Securitrons on the network. It makes quite a difference. With the M235 missile launcher, we can engage ground and air guns at long range. And a rapid fire exchange grenade launching system makes us deadly in close range engagements. Woo! Look at that! The OS upgrade also includes drivers for our onboard auto repair systems. Just try to hurt us now! All together, this software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness. Per unit. That's ridiculous. Uvengus finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. You can come back up and see me or be on your way. I know you're a busy person. That's that's insane. Shunned by Caesar's Legion, whatever, I don't care. So what do we do now? You did a super job. Here's some big news. I decoded it. I guess he wants to boost the troops' morale. But it... anyway, it looks like Mr. Why did Mr. House want Kimball alive? Mr. House ran projections on how the NCR public will react to a defeat at Hoover Dam. Overwhelmingly, they'll blame Kimball. But if Kimball dies at Hoover Dam, so that means reduced tourism for up to five years. The equations are pretty complicated. Mr. House sure liked numbers. I'm on good terms with the NCR. They'll let me help protect him. Gray, a ranger named Gray, once the president. This gadget I'm handing you is called an override module. Mr. House had two of these made years and years ago. Just like him to think ahead. Take the module to the El Dorado substation and attach it to the power control terminal. I'll handle the rest. I'll use the substation to send a huge jolt of electricity. With the reactor running at full tilt, I can boost the train. I'm talking direct tactical control of hundreds of up. Okay, so I need to protect Kimball and El Dorado substation.
So they already have the upgrades installed. All these Securitrons. What do you need? What do you want? Okay, so... Need to go protect Kimball. Report to Ranger Grant. Where is he at? Oh, at Hoover Dam. Boulder City is the closest. Let's see. That away. See, there's Kaiser's Fort over there. How do I get to this place? This is all hills. This way, I guess. I have no clue. What in the world? How do I get to this place? Head to the waypoint. I'm just going to follow that. I'm trying to discover the location, but I don't think I can do that first. It says they're right there, but... I can't jump over the rocks. Right? Nope. Okay. So I guess I go further around. Oh, look at that, more rocks. One of these I should be able to scale. Like that right there. I should be able to scale that. Is there a freaking wall right here? There's straight up a wall, so I must be able to walk this way. Oh, this road must lead to it. Talk to Ranger Grant. Oh, that's sick. I can see why they would fight over it. Pretty important location. Even just the old world ties to that name, Hoover Dam. I'd be in pretty important to control for one of the two founding, like, major factions. But what I'm going to do is just send an army of Securitrons at it and take it over myself. So I don't know what's exactly what's going to happen here. But I'm going to have the rifle equipped. Because so what's going to happen is either there's going to be a sniper themselves. Are you Ranger Grant? Hello? No. That's not where I go. Hoover Dam. Is he below me? heard of you. I'm glad you're here to help us out. This is a delicate matter. We've got a lot to do to prepare for the president. Oh, you're and we trust you, so you're free to security detail consists of rangers stationed here at the dam. Snipers and sharpshooters have been assigned to key locations, and we also have a sp I've also locked down act The Legion will def- I'd almost expect something direct from them. But since we don't have- Someone like you-
just gonna make a save. I don't know what will happen here, but We've got a I lot guess to I'm do guess I'm ready. Good. Is it me or has the Brotherhood stopped engaging us? Smart as glad you could join us. So I'll be overseeing this. It's a good bet that the Legion will do whatever it takes. Get the show on Once the road. So I can meet Ranger Grant. I can also investigate the area. So we're going to head outside here. See what's going on. What's this? Optional investigate the area for clues. That's Hoover Dam gun controls. Who are you? Nothing is going to happen to the president on my watch. So that gun control's fine, but there's probably other gun controls, right? Let's see. You better get out of here. Oh, shut up. I'm trying to keep your president alive. What in the world? What the heck just happened? Are you serious? That is crazy. Let's check this other deck. There has to be something. They wouldn't give the option to investigate if something, uh, something wouldn't happen. The gun looks fine. What about you? Nothing. Nothing is going to happen to the president on Monday. Hoover Dam Tower. What in the world are you? Okay. Well, the, the AA gun looks fine, so I guess we're just going to start this. I'll make a save before it really starts. And see what happens. I'm just glad to have the day off of this. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, well, let's make a save and we'll start this. More. I'll learn everything that happens here. And we'll see how it goes. Have you finished your security? Looks like that. Now if you Where does this vertebrate show up at? Here the vertebrate. Where does he land? So the three things I'd expect were like the AA gun, but that doesn't show signs of tampering. Either a bomb on the Vertibird or like a sniper from somewhere. So we're going to check all three. Let's use the ladder. This is presidential vertibird. Do you mind? I don't like the look of you. Examine the vertebrate. Nice, okay. Come back in a minute. I'm busy with security. Come back in a minute. Oh, shut up, dude, really? So we're going to keep an eye out for... This is the AA controls. I don't see anything unusual. Thank you, my fellow Californians. 
Oh, what is that? Who have come so far to answer the call to service put forth by the Republic. It is for you that I have come here. And it is because of you that I am able to do so. We enjoy our privileges because you take the greatest of risks and are prepared to make the most noble sacrifices. It is because of men and women like Private First Class, Jeremy Watson, that Nevada and the new California Republic remain free and secure. Born in a tin shack on the outskirts of one pine, Jeremy Watson never had an easy His father was a caravan guard on the short loop, and his mother, like many Californians, braved the ruins of the old world as a prospector. They, they suffer through, through water, water shortages, shortages raider attacks, attacks, and that's what you'd be keeping an eye. Like our mighty Sierra Nevada, I'll have a seat. They endured. But the, the time, time came when they could no longer show the bird alone. Not now. Twelve years Dude, I'm trying to report that there was a bomb on the vertebrate. I feel like that's pretty important. Troopers, rangers, just like you. And I don't like to look at these. One of these guys is getting close. Men and women step forward to say, I will carry the weight. And at Owens Lake, we made true on our promise, driving out the raider tribes to establish a lasting peace in the eastern Sierra Nevada. We carry the weight. Dude, what? I shot the wrong person, didn't I? Kimball's still alive, though. Okay, something happened here. I have an auto save when I exited the tower. So we're gonna have to reshoot that sniper. Come back in a minute. I'm busy with security matters. Dude, that engineer ran up to. Well, actually, I could probably just pickpocket the engineer, right? Where's he at? Got him down. And Let me find that engineer. That I am able to do so. We enjoy our privileges because you take the greatest of risks and are prepared to make the most noble sacrifices. It is because of men and women like Private First Class, Jeremy Watson, that Nevada and the new California Republic remain free and secure. Born in a tin shack on the outskirts of one pine, Jeremy Watson never had any easy. Shouldn't you be keeping an eye out? A bomb on the president. We have to get the president out of here now. We can't. His father was, was a caravan guard on the short, on the short loop. loop. And his and mother, mother, like many, many Californians, Californians, braved the ruins of the I'm going to keep vats ready for if I see an engineer. They, they suffer through water, water shortages, shortages raider attacks, attacks, and, and the brotherhood, brotherhood war. Like our mighty Sierra Nevada. You know what? We have a... I don't know if I need the... Sniper anymore, so... Sleepy time. Kimball's on his way, so... If I see a white vest booking it towards us... Let me check this. No tampering. Morning. Not now. Okay, chill out. I'm trying to help here. I'm trying to keep this dude alive. Let me uh, go up there with him. I want to know if there's gonna be any. Can I examine it again? Looks all good. Where's it at? Is that it? Morning. Good job today. We got the president out. Out safe and sound. And I couldn't have done it without you. You have my thanks. Good job. Okay. Now it's just Eldorado substation. So I think this is where we're going to... Okay, shut up, Ranger Grant. This is where we're going to end this part. Second to last part, I think the next part is literally just Eldorado substation. 
and I don't think it'll be a very long uh, recording, but it's just Eldorado substation, install that override chip, and then uh, head right into the final battle of Hoover Dam, where even though I just helped these guys, you were the dude that... Uh, You're the dude that killed them, but it's just the second battle of Hoover Dam. So we'll get right into that. Yeah, okay, they don't even get mad. You're definitely the bad guy there. I knew it. Okay, is that a freaking dog? Is that, that better be an NCR dog, right? Yep, okay. Well, this is where we're going to end this part. See y'all next time. Take care.